Hello and thanks for joining us from our studios in Israel. I'm Aaron Porras, here with ILTV's Morning Briefing. Syria has just accused Israel of launching a series of airstrikes on Syrian missile depots near Damascus. Israel, of course, doesn't comment on any alleged military actions, but sources do say that Israeli jets were in the area at the time of the attacks, which targeted Syrian long-range missile hubs. The Syrian military reports that they immediately returned fire at the Israeli aircraft, hitting one Israeli jet and managing to intercept three missiles. Analysts believe that this attack was targeting a weapons base specifically used to house long-range Scud missiles and launchers. This site is believed to be a major hub for Hezbollah forces and weapons in Syria. This comes less than 24 hours after Israel's security cabinet convened for a series of meetings to analyze the growing threats on the northern border, specifically Iran's increasingly tight entrenchment into southern Syria. The IDF chief of staff Gadi Eisenkot says that Iran sends up to a billion dollars to Hezbollah alone every year, with countless millions being funneled to other terror organizations throughout the Middle East as well, all targeting the Jewish state. Clearly, the army is prepared to take a proactive approach to prevent further Iranian entrenchment by any means necessary.